the parched bush country of southern Africa. Here it rains only twice a year, and then only briefly. But when it does, the ground in places erupts. Rain frogs, as they're aptly called, have been waiting for months below ground for this moment. After starving for so long, they're keen to feed. As darkness falls, the males begin to call. Females are fat with eggs. Males are so much smaller that they can't embrace a female. So they produce glue from glands on their underside and stick themselves to their partner's back. But sometimes that only results in a chain of enthusiastic but undiscriminating males stuck to one another. Their brief time above ground has come to an end. The female starts to dig. The diminutive male being stuck on goes with her. He will fertilize the eggs later below ground. Her stay on the surface is over. The female has excavated a little chamber for herself, and below that, she's made a second one, which is filled with a frothy foam. This is the nursery for her tadpoles. stays underground, away from the lethal heat, for several more weeks. 